Hello everybody, what's going on? Jerome here, and here for you guys, Master Builders! A brand new game that uh, should be a lot of fun. Ooh, we get to build a farm. But the way it works is you get five minutes to build something, whatever they want you to build. It's, it's all really up to this, so you get to choose what it is, and then from there you get to just try and make it your own as much as possible. So of course for this we're going to need to get ourselves some pigs, cows, chickens. I'm just trying to get everything possible that I may or may not need. We're going to go carrots. Potatoes, potato, po 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 potatoes. Uh, perfect. And I guess we will get some wheat. At oh, actually, we're gonna need a hoe. A hoe just to try and level the land. But yeah. So guys, pretty much at the end of this, you actually end up voting on whose design was the best. Uh, you know, I actually don't even need that. I should probably just use the dirt and get the rest of the water. And you vote at the end whose design you think is the best. I've had a lot of luck with games like this in the past. Uh, I'm really not that good of an artist, so I'll just be straightforward with that. But, but I tend to make some pretty awesome things, so I don't know. Hopefully you guys will like this. Here we go. And, uh, perfect. Alright, so I want to make an even little area just like that, and then just course we're gonna have to build up the traditional minecraft farm way and we'll just fill up this slot right here get some water going and hopefully hose do the hose work no hose okay perfect you can hold the land perfect that makes things a whole lot easier i'm also probably gonna put some villagers around here as well just to make this look super super good but there we go so we got potatoes going in now come on there we go and this side we're gonna do is carrots Make it look really cool. I don't want to use the traditional wheat because I feel like most people are going to be doing that. Here we go. I'm going to get carrots going all down the line. Ah. And we'll, we'll break that. We'll break that bad boy. All right. So not a bad setup for now. Definitely want to just surround it all with one extra layer of cushion so it looks beautiful. And then we can start working on the super cool things. Like I actually got a cooked chicken. When I wasn't paying attention and went for the chicken egg, I actually... Pulled out a cook. <laughs> that is honestly so embarrassing. That, that is one of the most embarrassing things I've done in a while. That is that is legitimately hilarious when you think about that. All right, so let's try and build ourselves a little caged-in area. We'll just go nothing too crazy, but you know, we'll do that. And then we're gonna want to build a fence gate. So we'll put that in there. And also, it's gonna sound random, but I wanna make it look muddy, cause that's kinda, you know, when, when I think of a pig pen, I kinda think of it like that. So oh, to do this though, we're probably going to, need, they're literally called pig. Yeah, cause to do that, we're gonna need it to be next to a water source. So I'm probably going to need, can I dig? I can't dig underneath, I was gonna say. I'm gonna have to think of some solution at some point. For now, we'll leave that though. We'll find a solution soon. All right, so we got the pig pen. We're definitely gonna need ourselves a chicken coop right next to it, probably. There we go. Let's, let's build a little room here. And actually, you know what we can do to make this even look look even better? We can build one of the typical little chicken farms. So if you guys if you guys know what I'm talking about here, I mean chicken farms not the right word, but you know the little chicken coops. So you go like this, you get the floor going. Then we can build with a. Wood. Let me see what types. Yeah, probably acacia, just to make it a little more reddish. So we go like that. Perfect. So if we have that going, then and we can just I'll build it up. Yeah, probably about that high. There we go. It's gonna look like a real chicken coop here. This is gonna be so cool. I think we honestly are gonna have one of the better designs out of everyone else. I, I'm just putting that out there. I, I think I think we're going to try and covering a lot of the areas that you know make me think of chicken coop. There we go, so let's throw some chickens in there. Alright! Alright, we're getting lucky! Um... But... But... Are you serious? Is there... Spawn chicken, there we go. I was like, is this a joke? I don't understand. There we go, so we got... This little area now. So they'll be chilling out there, then we can go across the top. Across the top, across the top, across the... Top and up. We're running low on time here, so I'm gonna have to go ahead and get. I'm just gonna grass up every area of the map that I haven't yet. So let's try and just make this look as good as possible. There we go. And unfortunately, if I had enough time, I would have built a farmhouse as well. But there's no way you could get everything done that you wanted to in this. So I'm pretty satisfied with this. And remember, guys, if you're enjoying this and like my designs, be sure to leave a like. It means a lot and uh, lets me know I'm doing something right. So here we go. We'll just kind of cage this area off just a tiny bit and around the back. Like that. Perfect. 
It's not it's not the best design, but I think it definitely looks really cute. So that's that's what I'm going for here. So that is our master farm, and the time is up. And now we have to anonymously vote on everything. Like, ooh, like this one's pretty pretty dang good. I like this. I'm gonna go with good. You know, like it's not nothing crazy, but it's definitely good. So I'm gonna go good. Oh, someone typed in chat lol. Maybe I'm an outsider. No, it looks like a lot of people. Yeah, I got satisfactory. That's what I. Yeah, it feels like a lot of people guess the same. Um, they literally just built a farm. Can you at least even walk in? Okay, this, this is 100% getting a meh. <laughs> this is 100 old McDonald's. Yeah, oh, well, that's a little extreme, but oh, all right, that was definitely a failure. I can't really, yep, that's getting a, I see what they did there. They literally built, uh, like, an automatic farm. Um, not really, I think, what it was going for. Oh my god, I got satisfaction. It was creative. That's the problem. It, that was a very creative answer because it's like an automatic farm. I don't know what that one makes, but I'm sure it makes something cool. This is, uh, it's okay. It's not, you know, there's, I've seen worse. It's definitely okay. Satisfactory. Yeah, exactly. I've been pretty on point with what my guesses are, uh, except for that automatic farm one. No, bad. <laughs> Literally, this had to have taken like 10 seconds. Bad. <laughs> my eyes are bleeding. That is what I gave it. <laughs> I love how just nice these are. There's, my, there's man, my eyes are bleeding. You know, the rest are alright. The rest aren't that bad. But yeah, failure. Ooh, this guy. Wow, everything's amazing. I wonder who made this. Amazing, 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 amazing. Unless people are idiots and think that's supposed to be a farmhouse. Hopefully they see it's a chicken coop. Please tell me. It's, it, they know it's a... God dang it! I guess they didn't know it was a chicken coop. Boo! I want to read out. Alright. Um. No. <laughs> Meh. Meh is definitely what I'm going for. This is... See, this thing was supposed to be an entire farmhouse. It doesn't even matter. Yeah, meh. Yeah, failure. Okay. I wonder how I stand. It'll tell you how you stand in the top ten votes. We know we didn't get first, but... Doesn't mean we necessarily did awful. Yet yeah, my eyes are bleeding again. This... So these ones are just why? Who makes these and why? Oh, jeez. For a second I thought I actually broke it. I was like, can I do that? Is that allowed? I guess so. <laughs> they let me destroy it. No, uh, another one. Well, they did the creative, like it's an actual farm, but... Uh, I mean, I don't know. I feel like that's just... I mean, I get the creativity behind it, but I, I'm just not feeling it, you know? Yeah, the person feel it too. Two people have the same approach to it. All right, let's see. Another one. All right, I mean, it, it's a farm. It's okay. It, <laughs> there's nothing special about this one. Can I break the wheat if I just fall? No, alright. That'd be too funny if I was actually able to break the wheat doing that. Satisfactory! Alright, yeah, I mean, that's about what I said, too, is okay. And I think that might be it. I can't imagine there's any more to vote on. And it tallied the votes, and we got... Oh, man, we got sixth place. Well, we tied for fifth. Actually, wait a minute, legitimately, we landed right in the middle. Because we tied for... Okay, wow, so we literally... We're like the 50% mark. We tied. like we, we were the 50% mark. So that was pretty cool, everybody. That was round one. We're going to roll into round two. And if you're enjoying it so far, be sure to leave a like. It means a lot. And uh, that's pretty much it. So stay tuned, everybody. We'll be right back. All right, everybody. We're back with the second and final round here. Ooh, we get to build a sailing boat. All righty. Um, well, let's go ahead and get ourselves ready. I'm going to probably need some dark wood. Imagining trapdoors. Wool is definite must. Um, let's go fence. What else might we need? Ladders to climb up the mast. See, I'm going for more of a pirate ship approach looking at this. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling really like a pirate ship kind of thing. So that's what, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to follow my heart on this one and try my best to build a pirate ship. Essentially, anyway. There we go. No promises on how good this is going to look, but we'll, we'll roll with it. And we'll see if that's what people like, too. They might get mad at me because they think it's, like, too abstract because, you know, I mean, technically it's... You know, pirate ships is not what they're going to build, but let's go with it. Let's go with it. If it has a, if it has a sail, I mean, they can't really say anything to me. It really is a, I mean, it fits all the credentials at that point. Um, I feel like I just messed up there somehow. Is that, yeah, I definitely messed up somehow. That looks good, actually. There we go. We'll build that out a little bit for the mast, and then underneath it, we can take care of building that. That's a pretty good outline, actually, already. That's actually phenomenal that we were able to do that. <laughs> I don't even know how that kind of ended up that way. I just kind of rolled with it and got extremely lucky. That was... Well, that looks really good, actually. That's pretty nuts. Um, well, of course, let's fill in that, and let's go make that. I don't know if that makes sense to you guys. It just When I think of pirate ships, I kind of think that a lot of them have that style of... Uh, not trapdoors, you know, that the grates, kind of, that you could see under. 
Okay, can I put... Oh, it won't let me... What, even even though I shift click, can I... I can't. Oh, no. Um, I guess we'll just fill it up with that, then. Ah, uh, that's annoying. That's annoying and unfortunate. Right, does it look better if I put that there? Mm, that looks all right. We'll keep that. All right. Um, then what else would I really need? Could probably, yeah, build up that bumper a little bit there. Oh um, yeah, you know I'm gonna build all around it. I'll build all around it. I'll build a little thingy around it. I'm like really concentrating right now. I'm sorry guys. I'm just I'm really feeling this design. Like I really think this is gonna be a great one. There we go. Okay, so we got all of that. And then we can always Yeah, I'd say that looks really good actually. That looks extremely good. Um alright, let's build a sail. It's gonna go up like this. So we'll three. You know what we'll do? We'll build it one more out. And then we'll go two, three, four. Yep, yeah, I'm just gonna go out like that. And then we'll meet it in the middle. Perfect. And it looks a little bad because technically that should be overlaying it on one side. So I'm gonna overlay this just like that. There we go. So that side, you don't even see the, uh, the sail part of it. So we got that. Now, Let's go with this end right here. We'll go with, I'm gonna do a second sail. And then I'm gonna also make a little bit of a perch. So we'll put this one here. I think the I think the second one's supposed to be bigger. So we're gonna have to build this one out a tiny bit. I'm gonna go six. So we're gonna go out a little more on that one. And same strategy, just pyramid style layer it up. And let's see. I don't even, I don't know. I'm a little afraid to look at what this looks like overall. But at the same time, I'm having a lot of good feeling about this, so we'll see. We'll see what comes about this for us. Let's see. Um, yeah, it's not bad. I don't know. We can just top that off like that, and then we'll go around the front side of it, because this is the side that what we wanted to overlap on the other side. And... Ah, there we go. Messed up already. Come on, come on. It's coming down to the wire now. One minute left, one minute left. Nope. Okay, and... Perfect! We got that, and now we have 30 seconds to build a little bit of a perch. So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to get creative here and be very, very quick about how we build this. So we'll go one, two, three, one, two, one, two. And then we go around that's so they have a way to, to climb up. We'll go fences all around. And one, two. And I'm just gonna go boom, boom, boom. And then the ladder's all the way up. Wow, okay. If we don't at least get, I I'm gonna go with second place or so on this one, I'm going to be disappointed. I'm gonna be disappointed because that is a sailboat. I mean, th there are definitely better sailboats, but keep in mind, in five minutes, that's pretty dang wild. Wow, okay, I'm really pumped right now because I know for a fact, the only thing we could have done different is maybe make the floor out of water, but I don't even. I don't even care. I think we got... Well, we already know this guy lost. <laughs> what is this? Please enjoy. <laughs> Honestly, it's so funny. I'm going to give him it's okay. Just because that is that is legitimately hilarious. But I really shouldn't. So, someone else is satisfactory. <laughs> wow. Oh, I really shouldn't have. Uh, that one, yeah. So that's... A, this is okay as well. I like the pro-America, the red, white, and blue. But really, that's... um. <laughs> someone goes beautiful. <laughs> it's 100% his design. Let me see real quick. It actually wasn't. Wow, it's surprising. Oh, man, that'd be so funny if that was his. All right, this one's meh. Just no, just no. There was, you could tell, zero effort went into this one. <laughs> Diamond for dates. Fantastic. Well, at least they tried bribing us. That's always a plus. I wonder if it'll let you type during your turn. Well, that's an extremely square ship. Um, I mean, technically, it's probably the best we've seen so far, sadly. So I'm gonna go with it's okay. Um, yeah, <laughs> there's no more words that can be said about that. Um, I love you, Jero. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you. Thanks, lol. <laughs> well, uh, I, I appreciate that, but um, definitely, definitely had to vote zero points for that. Um, <laughs> ooh, now this guy. Wow, everything's amazing. I'm, that guy's voting red. Why are you voting zero? Yo, yo, put that away. Put that away, man. 
Put that away. Put those reds away. What are those two doing? That was a beautiful ship. Thank you very much. Oh, this one's actually good. Oh, no, I said good, right? Yeah, I did say good. Yeah, I like this one. So I'm going to vote good for this one. And let's see. And the, the crowd says fail. Oh, wow. That one actually surprised me. I thought that was pretty good. Oh, that, that, this one's good. This one might be better than mine. Because it's, it is smaller. So I, it might be more like a sailboat. I'm just going to vote good. Let's see. Satisfactory. Okay. Yeah, that's what I, that's about what I said too. And, nope. <laughs> meh. I'll, I'll leave it at a meh because it's flying and that's kind of funny. But, <laughs> definitely going to have to go with a meh. Um, yep. Yeah. <laughs> kind of what I was expecting. I don't know what makes it a failure or not. Probably it has to get at least a two to not be a failure from everyone, but, um, meh. Meh again. It's too cramped, you know? I don't, I don't really get it. It's way too cramped. Good! Really? Well, he beat me. We know that for a fact. Um, oh, this one's pretty, this one's pretty good. That's crazy. So that guy already beat us. Then the guy that I thought was meh. Apparently everyone else was all over. They were feeling it. They were feeling his design work. I don't know. I'm not 100% on board, but you know, whatever. Good. This one's good too. That's what I said. Good. Nope. <laughs> nope. Hashtag nope. Instantly going in for the big nope. And let's see. The crowd says satisfactory. Yep. That's kind of what I was figuring. Um, well, is that it? Yeah, looks like he's tabulating the votes. And third place! Not bad. I mean, I was hoping for at least second, but I'll take third. I'll take the bronze better than tying for fifth with two other people. That's definitely for sure. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all we have time for today, guys. I do hope you enjoy. If you did, please smash that like button. And of course, share a comment down below with what you want to see in the future. Be sure to subscribe and also check out how to Minecraft, guys. I don't know if you've been watching me day to day, but it is back. It came back for season two about three days ago, and I've been doing it daily ever since, so... Yeah, go check it out. There'll be one later tonight as well if you want to hop on board. You don't need to see previous episodes to get involved in it, so just keep that in mind. Like, you know, don't be scared to jump three episodes and go, I, I can't catch up. You, you literally don't have to. Like, each day is a new adventure. I try to do something new each and every day so everyone has just as much fun from day to day and it, uh, it doesn't hurt anything else in the series. You're not going to miss something. So, yeah. Anyway, that's about it. Take care, everybody. Peace out, and I love you all.